Hello, Angel here. I hope you are having a fabulous day. It is Friday, Good Friday, 2021. And I just wanted to talk to you just briefly about what today is about. I am excited about where we are in the calendar and what we've been going through together as a community. I know that we've had a rough year. I know that going from 2020 here to 2021 has not been a normal or an easy journey. It has been rough. It has been filled with fears and, and distraction and all the obstacles and the things that create all the unpleasant, non-yummy things that happen in our system. But I want you to stop for a minute and think about where we are in the calendar. Think about what you're experiencing what you have experienced and then think about where we are what we're what we're commemorating right now good friday is the day we recognize when jesus was crucified jesus was crucified for all the things that we recognize today as the freedoms that we have that are inherent in our existence they say he died for our sins. What does that mean? He died for our sins. You can take on all manner of definitions for that. And I'm not here to start a religious conversation because I am not a pastor in a church. I'm not here to make you believe anything. I just want you to stop for a minute and think about where we are and let this day sink in for you that 2,000 years ago, something happened that gave us pause to change who we were and how we thought across the globe and our journey for peace and freedom, freedom to recognize one another, and freedom to commiserate and freedom to commune with our God the way we want to do so. As Jesus Christ himself asked us to. So as you meditate today, I want you to think about in your own process what you can do to bring your life into a place of accepting gratitude for not just the things that you have, but what has come before you that causes you to be where you are. That's, that's a true blessing. I want you to have a joyous day today. Stop and take time to give gratitude. Say thank you to people. Person opens the door for you. Thank them. Thank your mom. Thank your family. Thank your best friend. Thank your spouse. Because these people are with you as allies and friends and kinship. Jesus gave himself so that you could be free. Get out there and enjoy your freedom in his name. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Leave us not when in temptation but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Love is the answer. Peace is the goal.